feels weird to be recording another vlog when I haven't even edited the vlog from yesterday. But I'm getting ready to do that now. Um, so it's Tuesday, the 27th of October. Today's another day of working on the advents, so you won't see me in the studio much today. Like, I'll be in the studio, but I won't be recording as much in the studio today. Kids are at school, it's another overcast day, and, um, yeah, hoping that the week goes smoothly for everybody and we all get the stuff done we need to get done. I'm just rambling because I don't know what to say. <laughs> um, but I hope you all are having a good week, and thank you guys so much. I've gotten a few more coffees or ko-fis, um... And it's just been really, really nice of you to to support the channel in that way. So thank you guys so much. Um, and just for watching, even if you don't send a Ko-Fi. So, coffee. I don't know, what do people say? Do they say thank you for the Ko-Fi or thank you for the coffee? Hmm. But anyway, I'm going to get to work and uh, check back with you in a few hours. What are you doing? Okay, good morning. <laughs> okay, so <clears throat> my phone is going off like crazy. So it's been quite the day already. Um, I just got off the phone, well, a long process of being on the phone with um, the pharmacy. The past few weeks I've not been feeling well at all. I've been dizzy, so, 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 so tired and really depressed, um, and I thought a lot of it was just stress from, like, some things that are going on right now, but they suggested that I have low iron. Um, it runs in my family. All the women in my family are on iron supplements. That and I'm a vegetarian, so, you know, most of the time. I'm not eating enough meat to benefit from the iron and meat, so... Anyway, so um, they got me hooked up with that and um, a vitamin C tablet. So hopefully I start feeling better soon. Um, I am able to sit up a little better now, so that's good. I can get back to work, but um, yeah, that's been my morning. It's a little after 12 in the afternoon now, so we'll be going to get the kids soon. Um, and in the meantime, I'm going to keep working on this advent and... Uh, orders and try to take it easy. So I'm still not feeling super great, so, um, but I wanted to go with Adam to get the kids, so he's on his way out, and um, yeah, we're gonna pick them up. I'm just still feeling dizzy so um but I brought my knitting so that means I get to knit more than I haven't been bringing my knitting to pick up the kids as much because I always feel like the line's gonna move as soon as I look down so this way I can um, cast on a new project because I finished those lavender socks I was working on um, so yeah I will show those to you guys whenever we get home um, and cast on another pair and it's the, still the Lola sock pattern I just love that pattern so much it went so fast so that's what I'm gonna do the dolly dog. oh the dog okay that's right Maybe in front of the cupboard. Cupboard? Or the cabinet? The shelf? The bookshelf? Yes, but there's not enough room there. Oh. I have an idea. Okay. Here's the bed. Here we Oh, in the bedroom. Good idea.
Good evening. So I'm feeling a lot better. So um, I took the iron tablet at lunchtime, so about noon. It's just after 7 now, and a, the dizziness is completely gone. I am still a little tired, but this time last night I was like, I have to go to bed right now. So, um, yeah, I definitely feel better, but I wanted to show you guys the socks that I finished. Here they are. I love them. They need blocked, or at least washed. I don't typically block socks because they're going to block when they're on the foot. But, oh, it's just so lovely. And a slip stitch heel. And just a standard toe, which is all wrinkled. Yeah. And I actually made... This is how I knew I was feeling better too because I made so much progress and usually even just knitting lately has made me tired. But I got quite a bit done on this one. This is a tweed. It's the Stroll Tweed from Knit Picks in Barley Heather. No. Yeah, Barley Heather. It's just this really pretty grello. And then this little guy is not mine, or it is mine, but is not my creation. He is a crow from Lock and Lou. I'm gonna flip the camera around so you can see better. My little crow. I actually got two from her because my original plan had been to put a stitch marker here and here, but now that I have the pattern memorized, I really only need it right here. So that's okay, I still have two, just in case one breaks or I wanna use it on multiple projects. Because as we all know, I love ravens and crows, so 